It's time to meet Doc's Dumb Dumb of the Day. Thank you, Chris. Today's Dumb Dumb comes from Denham Springs, Louisiana. Okay. 56-year-old Miguel Rodriguez had a rough day at work last Friday. Hmm. Really rough. I mean, we've all had rough days, Mm -hmm. but ours don't usually come with a price tag quite as steep as Miguel's. (laughs) He works for a Texas-based trucking company called International Machine Transport. Okay. Friday morning, he was... Transporting machinery with his truck, I guess. <laughs> when out of nowhere, an overpass and simple math really ruined his day. Uh-oh. Can you guess? Uh-huh. Do you see what's coming? Yeah. Miguel didn't. <laughs> Let's just say he miscalculated a wee bit. Sure. He had 15 feet to work with. Unfortunately, his cargo was 15 and a half feet. Uh-oh. Not counting the trailer. Mm. So not even close. <laughs> And that's how a $30 million helicopter became wedged under the I-12 overpass on Range Avenue Friday morning. Whoopsie. They're $30 million? Huh. They had to shut it down while crews worked to free the whirly bird. Luckily, no damage was done to the road or the overpass. The same cannot be said for the helicopter. I bet. Miguel was ticketed for careless operation, which is a minuscule punishment compared to the phone call he had to make that morning to whoever owned that helicopter. For the record, there are signs in both directions letting anyone else too tall for their own good know it's 15 feet. Mm -hmm. That part's kind of not negotiable. (laughs) Not a lot of wiggle room. Just ask the helicopter. (laughs) Sorry, Miguel. A wise man once said, measure twice. And even though you're not the first man to say, I think I can make it. You are Doc's Dum Dum of the Day.